Okay, for this video, we'll be updating this Mi Box S, which is running currently in Android 9. And let's check if there is still system update. So just checking, it's already running in Android 9 and your system is up to date. There's no downloadable update for the current version of the Mi Box S, which is 2021 patch version 9. So for this test, this video will be updating this manually. So I have this USB, which is a preloaded Android 12 device. So I'm gonna remove the USB to LAN. So there's no internet right now. And just insert this. And make sure that you are running this. Um, go to the reset. So the USB with a preloaded. Don't worry, I will share you the link where I downloaded the update file that is in here, the root of the USB. So specifically for the Mi Box S Gen 1. So you just need to reset, as you can see, it, reset, erase everything. Then after erasing everything, so after erasing, so just wait for it. When you see the logo, now it will erase, okay? Wait for it. It's going to, yeah, erasing. Then when you see another reboot, just press the center and the back button. Pressing the center and the back button of the remote while booting the Mi Box is going to the recovery mode. So hold it as much as you can. Wait for the instruction. Now first reboot and second. And now you can see this. This is a very critical steps. So what we are going to do is this one apply from ext where our external device or our usb preloaded so external device update from udisk and click update udisk then i have this update the update that zip file which i will share the link on the video description then you just run it so installing the system update as you can see a while ago there is no online update so we are overriding the android update for the mi box s so first time you will see that the mi box s gen 1 will be running in through android 12 and wait let's just wait and as you can see it will run and another reboot then another cycle so you you don't need to press anything so that's the first reboot and now it will go back to the recovery mode just wait for a several take time just wait for it I'm, uh, no command so here the letter so we are still using the remote then apply update from udisk okay so udisk apply update from udisk that's the only thing option we're choosing so another this is the same file that is update.zip to be shared in the links and now installing system update after that it will continue to install then the system will need to reboot so I'm just gonna pull pause the video or speed it up for you now it's almost installing system update it's almost finished and it will go back to the original menu now Update boot looter and now you need to reboot the system and now you can actually remove the USB disk 
while rebooting and insert the internet the ethernet cable for the i i don't use wi-fi for my mi box s i just use the ethernet the usb cable now first time to run a few steps just to check previously the mi box is running now it's android tv okay so that's the difference it means that it's already running in the android 12 software okay so now running after the reboot of the update so you can check the the device preference about and now we're running in a android 12 tv os version so it's absolutely to run the android tv os on a mi box s which is a first generation all right so no more problems about time and date so see you around guys thank you if you learned something about this video please share this this is the permanent solution for the time and date you need to set up so thank you and see you around